Hey everybody, it's Devin here at Predatory Plants. It's a nice cool morning in the greenhouse and the fans aren't on yet, so I decided to do a bit of a bench tour. This is one of our big female Nepenthes Rob Cantlii. You can see it's got pictures sort of all uh, up in here. It's a little hard to get photos of it, but it's a really nice big, uh, big female. She's maybe two and a half feet in leaf diameter. She's got this nice big uh, flower spike. So uh, we've got some fun hybrids coming there. Right here, this is Nepenthes ventricosa maishta os. It's a really beautiful form of this uh, species that's uh, got a nice coloration and a cool big lid. It's a little bit hard to grow. This one tends to not grow as well as some other forms, but uh, it's been doing better in our warm room. Here we've got a little cluster of Nepenthes gymnophora. which is a fun little cubby species uh, that's, that's quite cute and hybridizes really well. Uh, this particular plant is in a kind of a small growth phase, but it just got repotted, so maybe it'll start uh, growing a bit bigger again soon. Here we've got Nepenthes alba, which is a fun plant that's known for its uh, pure white uppers. This is kind of an intermediate. It hasn't gone to a true upper yet, but it's getting there. Maybe this one will have a little bit more of that true upper uh, quality to it. This one's also a female. Um, that we pollinated. It's got good pollination, it looks like. Uh, let's see what we put on here. A bunch of weird stuff. We've got tenuous, lavicola, sibionensis, rabcanli, and ventricosa. So those are all very weird hybrids. Uh, that'll be pretty fun if those work out. Right here is one of our big Nepenthes tibiais. Uh, Nepenthes, yeah, Nepenthes tibiais. This is a plant we call tapestry. We've used it in a few hybrids. Uh, it's uh, sort of a not the most dramatic looking tibiae, but it grows really well. Uh, that's a lower here. We've got a nice upper right there. Uh, as you can see, it's a pretty serious plant. This one's probably five, six feet tall. Um, very vigorous and it, and it produces a lot of pollen. Over here is Nepenthes madagascariensis, which is a little bit of a difficult plant to grow, but this one's doing pretty okay here in the warm conditions. Still on the uh, lower pitchers rather than the more well-known uppers. Uh, but it's a nice little bush. Hopefully um, it'll continue to grow well, although it does best in the summertime. Uh, it might decline a little bit over the winter. This plant was featured in one of our first videos on this channel. This is our main Nepenthes jacqueliniae. This is actually a big basil it has. with just an incredibly uh, perfectly formed lower pitcher there. Just stunning. Uh, and then the main vine has true uppers on it. We didn't have these in the last video, but you can see it's like a almost totally flat peristome, uh, solid green, just really, really gorgeous. And it's getting pretty big. I mean, you can see there's the vine. This thing's probably five or six feet tall. Hopefully we'll get a flower off of that soon. Um, let's see, over here, right here, there's Nepenthes mustersiana. Uh, no, not Mesterziana. Nepenthes, yeah, no, Mesterziana, uh, which is um, Nepenthes sanguinea by Cassiana, which is a classic old uh, Mester, Mester, yeah, Mesterziana, which is a classic old Victorian hybrid. Um, so we got this in a trade maybe about a year ago. It's a pretty nice plant. And it's got nice texture to the, um, the pitchers, nice and waxy. Uh, you can see the Cassiana lid there. Uh, pretty charming. It, this one's another sort of like scrambling vine that's all over the place. We really need to stake it. Uh, it'd be super fun to get a flower on this because what a weird plant to breed with. Uh, as you can see, the uh, lowland bench here is a little bit crazy. We've got some work to do uh, tidying this all up. But there, there's some great stuff in here like this wavy leafed Maxima, uh, which is the purple leaf variety. Uh, the pictures are, are fine, you know, it's, it's a perfectly good plant, but obviously um, the, the wavy leaf margin is a really cool thing here. Uh, ooh, here's a big Nepenthes sumatrana uh, pitcher. There's the, there's the main plant right there. Uh, doing pretty nice. We've got a couple of uh, sumatrana that um, are just starting to get pretty serious. They could afford to be repotted and then they'll probably be, you know, six feet in diameter or something. Um, the last thing I wanted to show is over here, I just noticed it a minute ago, is this really nice, really nice Rafflesiana pitcher. 
That's a, this is a pretty difficult lowlander for us because we're in San Francisco, so we don't have the real ultra lowland conditions that would make it go crazy. But you know, there's the plant, it's, it's decent sized, uh, but just really gorgeous with that uh, sort of camo pattern coloring. Uh, with like the white and the red. It's like it's a very, very striking plant. I think I've seen this one in uppers uh, before and it maintains some of that exciting coloring. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this bench tour. Uh, obviously, we've got a lot more to uh, show off in the future, but I just thought I'd you know, take a little peek around in case uh, people wanted to see what we've got going on at the end of summer. If you want to see more videos like this, remember to like and subscribe and feel free to ask any questions in the comments.